New Line's DC superhero movie Shazam has found its Billy Batson. Asher Angel from Disney's Andy Mack is stepping into the role and the young actor joins the previously announced Zachary Levi who will play Batson's adult superhero alter ego Captain Marvel. The film is continuing to fill out the cast as it heads toward a Toronto-based production kickoff in early 2018. Here's what we know about Shazam so far. The DC entertainment story centers on a boy, Batson, who transforms into an adult superhero known as Captain Marvel when he says the magic word, Shazam. The word is an acronym of the ancient world gods and historical figures Solomon, Hercules, Atlas, Zeus, Achilles, and Mercury, from which Batson derives his heroic attributes when in adult form. David F. Sandberg is directing Shazam off the back of Annabelle Creation's huge success. The $15 million horror sequel, also helmed by Sandberg, has earned $303 million worldwide since opening in August. The Hollywood Reporter exclusively revealed Levi's casting as Captain Marvel in October. The role is a big one for the actor, who is known for comedic roles and starred on NBC's hit spy comedy series Chuck from 2007 to 2012. He also has superhero film credentials and can be seen in Marvel Studios' Thor Ragnarok as Fandral, one of Thor's companions. Levi also recently appeared on NBC's Heroes Reborn and the Eva Longora comedy Telenovela. When his casting was announced, Levi shared a message as well as some art imagining him as the character on his Instagram account. Honoured and greatly humbled to be a part of the DC Universe by bringing the original Captain Marvel to life, the actor wrote. I am beside myself with gratitude not only for this opportunity, but also the incredible outpouring of love and support from so many of you out there in the world. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be in the gym for the rest of forever. Mark Strong is also in talks to join Shazam in the villainous role of Dr. Savannah, Captain Marvel's longtime arch nemesis. The mad scientist has traditionally been portrayed as one of the smartest men alive, but he squandered his gifts on ridiculous inventions that no one could understand, turning him bitter, twisted, and eager to do the wrong thing as long as it helped him out. Strong previously starred in 2011's Green Lantern, playing the classic DC villain Sinestro, and has his own comic book credentials, having played the villain in 2010's Kick-Ass. He's also appeared in 2015's Kingsman, The Secret Service, and September's Kingsman, The Golden Circle. Shazam is eyeing a February start date in Toronto. The film is being developed concurrently with a project focusing on Shazam villain Black Adam set to star Dwayne Johnson. Heat Vision first reported in July that Shazam will be the next DC Cinematic Universe movie to film ahead of Flashpoint, Joss Whedon's Batgirl and the Suicide Squad sequel. No release date for Shazam has been set. To read more on New Line and DC Shazam, head to THR.com and tell us, are you on board with the casting choices so far? And are you excited to see who will be announced next? Let us know in the comment section. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Lindsay Rodriguez.